Hey everybody, welcome to Far Cry Primal. So, everything's finally semi good and set up. The upload rate is stable. I'm not getting kicked off the internet if a far fl if fly farts on the fucking router or anything. So, since I got a massive backlog going, I figured why the fuck not? I've been having fun playing this since it came out a couple days yesterday. So, screw it. Let's be a caveman. Bunga bunga. We're just gonna stick to normal. I'm keeping the search animations off because there's a lot of gathering in this and you're literally scooping shit up left, right, and center. And that time is going to add up. And it's just, it's gonna get really annoying to have to watch. I mean, solo play, it's no big deal, but, you know for a let's play where if you're picking up like 60 things and each one takes a second and a half and a 20 minute video you get it doesn't necessarily add anything um other than that uh motion blur is turned off for those of you who i know have uh you know issues i find it annoying anyway so it all works out and it's all subtitled because, well, <laughs> they all speak caveman talk. <laughs> yeah. I'll bitch about that. We want Zog Zog. By the way, the thing on the title screen about day one patch, uh, don't really mean a whole lot. Um, the game's been remarkably stable and bug free. And from Ubisoft, I'm fucking surprised. They're usually the bug masters. <coughs> I do have the graphics turned on slightly just to make sure everything runs perfectly smoothly but as yeah, looks great it's on normal by default it started at a, the auto detect 
started me out on high settings, but it's, it's kind of like if I light too much shit on fire at once, then it gets the occasional frame skip. But then again, that's, of course, me lighting everything in sight on fire, being a dickhead, because... I mean, how else are you supposed to take a mammoth down to level 2? Shoot in the head with a flaming arrow! And then, play fucking Matador with it. Mama Fuaidamas, Chadubi Dashimas, Tu Hadamas. And then, Snoo Snoo! Text me so. You, on the other hand, you're fucked. My Shanchita Dakar.
Taking your swag. Damn it, Mr. Big Kitty. Okay. I need a bow. Hunter vision. So yeah. Got some slate. Got some wood. Got some more wood. Just see the amount of stuff we're gathering up in a short amount of time. And you can see why I'm deciding I'm just going to keep the... I'm just going to keep the gathering animations off for the sake of the let's play. Okay. So I can just kind of <clears throat> run about and... Make the basic bow. Bum, 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 bum. We need to tie a stick together. So now we have two sticks and a piece of twine. And eight pointy sticks. To hunt effectively, approach prey slowly and crouch, use hunter vision, you hit them, they bleed, they run, they'll eventually bleed out. I hear Mr. Big Kitty. Goaty monsters. Where are you, goaty goat? Now one Mr. Goaty Goat. Mr. Big Kitty.
Yeah, you pretty much gotta gather everything in this game. As far as I'm aware. As far as I'm aware, there are no shops. So there's no black market caveman standing around going, Bunga Bunga, what you trade, stranger? Panti Shastango. Make club carry fire. To upgrade club, we need story missions. Weapons at fires, or we can use animal fat to light them on the ground. Oh, I lost some of my arrows. Ah, I saw Mr. Big Kitty. Parts though, where you gotta track things with the hunter vision, they're okay, but that color red that they have when you're trying to track stuff really fucks with my eyes when I'm trying to track something through the greenery. Apparently, I lost my one. You scare him beast with fire? I shoot him beast in head. Me no pussy. Me kill him wolf. Wolf worth experience. Bad for wolf. Well, I got all my arrows back, so then nothing broke. And I hear Mr. Big Kitty. Face plant here. Way to face plant. Winjaharha, Hawalnayaka. Just start to heal wounds. Hmm. 
Well done. Anyway, I'm going to cut it right here and we'll be right back.